Hey what's going on guys, my name is Brad, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. Today we're talking about two new Yu-Gi-Oh! video games and some news that's come out of the most recent V-Jump June 2016 issue. Now, starting off with Yu-Gi-Oh! Sakyo Card Battle, which is the 3DS game which I covered earlier this week, there'll be a link to that in the description. Yugi and Kaiba are both going to be featuring in the game, so it fits up with that Dual Monsters timeline I talked about in that video, and they're going to be using a Blue Eyes White Dragon and a Dark Magician theme deck respectively. So, you know, it's very straightforward for Yugi and Kaiba. And now moving on to Dual Links, the mobile game coming out at the end of this month in Japan. We've had a couple of new bits of information released about how we're going to acquire cards and how the game progresses. So first of all, you can dual NPC duelists in the dual world mode to get cards, or you can buy booster packs via gems, which are login bonuses or bonuses you get from leveling up your character. Packs cost 50 gems or 120 yen, so you can also pay real life money for them. I'm not sure how much 120 yen is, but I don't think it's that much, so it should be a pretty decent amount of cards you can get in the packs, and the pack we see on screen here has Blue as Ultimate Dragon on it, so that's cool. You start the game as either Yugi or Kaiba, so you know, we're following on, it's big on that Dual Monsters uh, theme this year, with obviously with the movie and all the nostalgia happening. And you can level up to earn skills, skills that you do things such as uh, set fields in play when the duel begins, such as the field Yami, automatically giving your monster power boost. Obviously this, this method of dueling is very different from the standard one that we're accustomed to. Also on screen now you'll see one of the new NPC designs, you can see it looks like a Domino High School girl, you know, they're wearing the same uniform that Taya wears, it literally looks like they're taking Taya's like, character design and just put a new head on it, which I'm totally fine with, it's in the Dual Monster universe, it's 100% fine. But that's it, that's all we have for today on the game, so hopefully there'll be a bit more information soon, especially with Dual Links coming out so soon. Um, I'll try and get gameplay of that as soon as possible. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.